students across the United States and the world have taken to the streets to demand climate change. The protests are uh, partly inspired by the activism of Swedish teenager Greta Thunberg, who has staged weekly demonstrations under the heading Fridays for Future over the past year, calling on world leaders to step up their efforts against climate change. Thunberg is expected to speak at the UN Climate Action Summit on Monday. According to the Associated Press, more than 800 events are expected throughout the, the United States that day. There's going to be a lot going on. In London, labor leader Jeremy Corbyn was also seen joining the protesters as rallies were held across the United Kingdom. Corbyn also addressed the students and thanked them for their determination to combat climate change and to protect our environment and our planet. Now, meanwhile, hundreds of rallies were held by students across the globe. They were seen marching with banners and pro, uh, posters, changing and chanting for climate change, urging their leaders to take concrete steps to secure a better future for generations to come. Now, not all students across the world were able to participate, though, with the New York Times reporting that no protests were authorized in China, which is the world's biggest source of greenhouse gas emissions. On Monday, world leaders will assemble at the United Nations headquarters in New York to attend the Climate Action Summit, and more protests are planned for the day in several cities across the globe. The last global march for climate change led by students was held in March of this year. Looks like the movement is still going very strong. We'll keep you posted on all of that.